Hello, hello, hello. Oh, hey, martial art. How's it going? Hold on a second. I'm still setting up some things here. Give me a moment. Do, 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 do. Very enjoys. Need to reorganize my OBS. Something like weird happened and things went all jacked up out of place. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> excuse me, excuse me. Don't classes even sooner than normally since one of your students decided to not come today. Nice. Just push it on to another day. <clears throat> ah, excuse me. All right. I worked a little bit on her over the weekend because I was mostly doing freelance work over the weekend. But uh, honestly, she's so simple. I think I'm ready to start posing. That Tuesday, so I don't have to work. <laughs> All right, let's put her somewhere like, I don't know, right here, I guess. No, took up too much screen real estate. Let's do something more like that. Yeah, I mean, she's pretty much done. She's bald. I mean, most of the uh, the anatomy I need a scope will be in the pose. Which is fairly simple. And so now I guess I just... Yeah, I'm just going to get into posing. Nagatoro Monday and the, the coffin game's first anniversary. The game's been out for a year. Let me just rename some of these things before I go into posing. Head. Eyes. Eyelid. Oh, the first episode. These are the uh, lashes. Takes care of that. The torso, we're all good there. Arms are good. Oh yeah, the hair. Have I properly named them? Nope. Oof. What the hell do I call this thing? Hair top. And hair top too. Here, front. Depending on how I pose this, uh, I'm going to have to figure out how I'm going to be splitting these, like, massive hair pieces off of her. Putting my money, Nagatara is going to take Senpai to bed in today's chapter. <laughs> Where did I put my reference? Need to bring that back. Bring, 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 bring it back. All right. Actually, before I start posing, I do want to work on her. Her little, her little tummy tum.
Over the weekend, my weekend was uh, was fine. I spent part of it just relaxing, and then the other part of it doing some some freelance work. I hope your weekend was good. Way too strong, way too strong. Still too strong. Much better. Let's skip this one. And this one. Okay, there we go. Boom, 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 boom. Take it down to point one. Lower the intensity. I think let's lower it a bit more. Rather good. Good. It's good to hear. Oh, I can't see that. Where is it? Oh, there you are, Keto. My reference is blocking. That seems a bit weird in a three-fourths view, but she looks good. I'm going to take another look at the eyes. The eyes. Real eyes. See real eyes. I mean, I guess ideally you want it to be like pretty flat, but making some compromises when it comes to the eyes. Actually, one thing I'm noticing, this eyelash isn't really following the contours. My eyes lay on her massive hips. <laughs> you know what? Actually, let me sculpt just a bit more anatomy before I... Before I move um, into posing. Wrong one. I want to grab you. I'll grab a you. This year, I really, really do need to buy myself proper, proper office chair. I'm always like shifting my like seating position and that's not good. Mm 
Be back, all right. Hey, Hudson, how's it going? How you been? Degrees, my goodness, <laughs> that's a hot one. Jeez, that is impressively warm, <laughs> and it's only like it's, it's barely April and night one in the morning, 91 degrees. She is there at least like a breeze at the very least is there a breeze if not i feel so sorry for you Seventy-seven. Okay. All right. That, that that sounds sounds better. So I was gonna say ninety-one, and it's barely even April. Like I know it's hot there, but it's extreme. <laughs> Seventy seven sounds better. <laughs> All right, that takes care of shoulders. Dum dum dum. <clears throat> Give me a second here. Does it feel like 77 to be honest? More like probably because I'm I'm betting it's like really humid where you at. That humidity is like adding adding to it, making it hotter. Very humid, yeah. Dun, dun, dun. 
push of snow. And we haven't gotten any like snow in my neck of the woods in quite some time. Like nothing aside from like flurries. <clears throat> yeah, I don't, I don't know why you would, <laughs> you would get heaters in your area. Unless if you're a psycho. All right, let's, I want to. The booba's got to go away for a moment. So that I can. Do this. I do this. I do that. I do this. I do this. I do that. Yeah, the, the T-Post is like almost done. I'm like about ready to... to start posing. Oh, shit. Hmm. No, let's not do that. Okay, that's better. Uh, I don't really have a solid pose in mind, but kind of, kind of, sort of, sort of, kind of, we'll see. Just want to really give it a once over, see if there's anything I want to push. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, I completely lost myself and all that. Tie those arms again. And then. And then thighs are going to be extra thick. quick so I can actually see what I'm sculpting the whiteness is like kind of blinding my eye couldn't see what I was doing gigabot <laughs> of anatomy there ah, I guess I'm fine Then I save this again as my T post file. Save the project file. Alright, 
I bring up some like reference ideas I had for the posing. All right, let's uh, kind of brainstorm my way through a pose. Trampose master, T pose mesh. Hopefully I didn't have anything masked, but okay. Okay, okay. How am I gonna start this? Auto group. Then down here as well. Actually, let me have those on there. Auto group. As being a character artist also requires rigging and animation knowledge. It requires that knowledge so that at least basic understanding of that knowledge so that you can like work because you'll be working with uh rigging artists and not so much animation artists but definitely rigging artists like if you're working on a game or a film you will have like you know moments where you have to collaborate with them because there'll be like something that they need on the model like done differently to like help with rigging yeah it's not so much that you need to know it so that you can do any like rigging but so that you can you can do the work with their work in mind if that makes sense hold on give me a moment here my cat's bothering me for some food be right back All right, I'm back. It's not so much that she needs me to give her food, but she doesn't start eating until I start petting her. Spoiled cat. <laughs> Do I have any ideas for the non-safe work version? I'm, I'm going to have them both have, like, be in the same pose. Okay. Let's start selecting some of these parts. Oops. Mask that. Actually, I'm going to need these ones not as well. Dog wouldn't eat until my parents would feed them. I'm spoiled to that point. Well, sounds like my cat. All right, let's have her leaning forward there. Something like that. And then choose mask lasso. Blur that out. Character character artist is the most oversaturated position based on what we're seeing on the internet. I was talking about this before. It's oversaturated in the sense that a lot of people want to be a character artist, right? But I would say like 90% of them are not ready to be a professional character artist. So the pool of like actual qualified artists you're up against is a lot smaller. But still, you can, you can like just easily get lost in that ocean of people taking their shot, so to speak. But it's also, I guess what make like, let's say there's only for like, if you're applying to like at a sp specific studio, right? Let's say there's only like actual 20 viable candidates. But a character artist team at a game studio will like 
at the generous side be five. It's definitely the smallest team on a production. And how easy to start doing. There's not much technical stuff you need to know to start sculpting. I mean, if you're if you're just doing what I'm doing, which is like figures for for 3D printing or working in like toys and collectibles and that kind of stuff, yeah, it's just art. But if you were doing it for like games or animation, especially games, there's a lot more technical work to it you gotta know how to properly retopologize you gotta know all about like texturing texture maps what makes a good uv map what makes good topology you gotta be able to demonstrate an ability to be able to put in the game engine understand how all that stuff works game art's just a lot more technical As a beginner, I've seen so many portfolios of sculpts that aren't even halfway finished. Yeah, but I'm... <laughs> you don't need to worry about those portfolios. You got to worry about the people that do finish their stuff. Whoops. All right, let's see. Let's see just how far I can I can push this. Like just like really really break it you're watching indie cartoon on youtube like if you mean like those like one-offs mm, yes i have there's been many over the years in a way so that I can like move her hair pieces so you can I know everybody's gonna want to have a view of her backside so I'm trying to make that available <laughs> have a boss who okay I've seen I've seen none of those and I've only ever heard of the first one a little bit more that way. Murderous drones. <laughs> I'm gonna love it. You can't make me. No, I'm kidding. Let me bring this leg forward some more. I'm currently like watching it with uh with my brothers like every friday we watch like an episode or two i think we only have like i don't know three left three episodes left something like that 
Uh, it's iffy. It's like, I don't know. Some things are hit or miss. Some things are good. But that the, the third episode was just awful. <laughs> I did not like the third episode. Third episode was just bad. They, they, they did boomy dirty. I did not like what they did to him. To... Animation is better. <laughs> I mean, like all the 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 CG effects for all like the bending and the fighting and all that stuff. All that is pretty cool. Some changes are weird. Or like, why? Like, why did you decide to change that? Some very few changes are like, okay, that's a nice change. Most changes are just kind of like, why? For me, the characters are good. The thing that I don't like is that it feels too generic, like MCU. Feels very much samey. Hey, Vicky. Do you know how to set up background in Maya so I don't want to create a whole city? I don't know what you mean. You want to set up a, a background? Like you want, like you want to make like a city background, but you don't want to have to make a whole city. Is that what you're asking? Yeah, uh, pretty much what Hudson Hudson says. Just put a big flat plane there. Put a texture of like a cityscape. A skyline of sorts. And and Bob's your uncle. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much all you have to do. Yeah, I haven't used my in forever, but that's what I would do. If I if I couldn't be <clears throat> excuse me, if I couldn't be bothered to model something out, I would do that. You can even take it a little step further by, um, let's say you have it, you have that image plane set up to a camera and you know, you, you get the, the perspective correct. And then just kind of like uh, model out really, really basic cubes and project that as a texture onto a cube and voila. I, I've seen plenty of you uh, tutorials on YouTube that basically does what I just described where you have like it let's say like a like some city skyline kind of deal and you set up the camera correctly to match the perspective of that image and then from that perspective you just model out really basic cubes and you have that image 
projected onto all the basic cubes you have modeled out so that this way it looks a little bit more fancy without having to like literally go crazy with the modeling hey Eris I don't know what the designer thinks of all the Serena eludes <laughs> If I was them, I'll be like, yeah, job well done. <laughs> be a chair for soon. I mean, I'll, I'll just all these shapes later. I just kind of want to connect them. Channel name? Oh, I don't, I don't know the channel name, Vicky. I, uh, search for it on YouTube. I'm saying there are a lot of videos on YouTube. You can find that. I don't have any specific channel in my in my memory right now. I just know that I've seen plenty of videos like that. Damn it. Did one based on Live for the Funks art of uh, of Serena? Alright, let's have this arm like on her heaps. Maybe I should make one. I haven't touched Maya in so long. Uh, you can... You can try. I don't know if like YouTube is going to block you. I think YouTube will probably block you. Hmm. Hmm. I have it going backwards a little bit. the position of this like shoulder piece later just want to get like the general position the journey of your animation what was the first software you used and why did you shift to zbrush oh man the heart is like blocking i can't see what that last word is zbrush how you know about the animation well, i mean i started in maya all the way back in 2007. Learned 3D on that. Because I originally wanted to work in games. And then I'd say sometime around, I don't know, 2009, 2010-ish, ZBrush came into the picture. ZBrush was becoming more 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 of a viable program then when i graduated and i got like my first freelance job it was working for an outsourced game studio and i was doing my work in maya at the time 
And then after that contract was done, I got a contract to work on miniatures and they were primarily using ZBrush. And I've just been using ZBrush since then. I haven't done any game work or anything like that. I don't really animate. I mean, I did a little bit, but I was never an animator professionally. Only ever like a, a 3D modeler professionally. Started off with like environments and then characters. And then here I am. Did you crack it or did you buy it? Well, I was a very poor and broke college student. So at the time, so I'm sure you can uh, figure it out. <laughs> now, what am I going to pose for the left arm? Left arm. As long as it's only for you. Truth be told, Autodesk knows of all their cracked copies. Like like if you think Autodesk doesn't know that like the 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 key that you have for your cracked copy isn't crack, then I got news for you. <laughs> Links are blocked. Yeah, I figured it they are. If you're if you're in the Discord Eris, you can uh Post it there. Eris Manor Serena. Eris Manor Serena. Let's see here. Eris Manor Serena. <laughs> totally not Serena. DeviantArt is blocking me. You want to know your PC RAM storage? And if Autodesk no, then why not block it? Real question is, would they bother? Yeah, you see, like, Autodesk knows. But it's not worth it to them. But like, let's say if you set yourself up like a little small studio, right? And you started making something with Maya. And then you made it known that you made something with Maya. And then you're making decent money. Like, I'm talking decent money. Then Autodesk is going to come knocking on your door. That's when they'll care. <laughs> like, let's say you started some kind of in the animation studio and you made something and it hit big and it's making a lot of money then Autodesk is going to pay you a visit shit what am I going to do with this this left I don't want to bring it too close to the or maybe I, I should bring it close to the body hmm Or maybe... And if you live in China, the government will knock on your doors. <laughs> Where's our money? Every, everybody just wants their, wants their cut. Like, give me my cut. Where is it? Hey.
Okay, this is actually getting somewhere. All right. To be fair, they're not really strict if it's an educational version. So plus points, maxing as well. RAM and storage? I mean, I have more than you'll ever need. <laughs> Uh, I've said it a few a few times in previous streams. I have 256 gigs of RAM and for storage. I I have a uh, network storage, like a, a few dozen terabytes. Don't mess with poo. <laughs> you are, you you don't need anything close to to what what I have, <laughs> honestly. You you can you can get by with far far less. And different programs require different things, you know? Like uh ZBrush is pretty like RAM hungry. Whereas something like Maya Max Blender you need like pretty decent CPUs and, but more importantly, a good graphics card or any of that rendering stuff. All right, something like this is nice. You know, kind of like that, like she's kind of like laughing at you kind of deal. Like she's like, I know you're looking, tee hee. <laughs> I want to churn her head more. Dom you mommy. <laughs> Blender updates too much. <laughs> well, at least it's free. <laughs> Yeah, this is why you don't trust chat GPT. <laughs> I've said it before, I think on, on my motherboard, like the absolute maximum uh, RAM capacity it can do is one terabyte. But at that point, it's more like, it's more like server capacity RAMs. Yeah, 100% free. You can't beat free. You can never beat free. Free is an unbeatable metric. Still something about hmm. it's balanced, that's for sure, but Turn this music down in my ears. Have you used U5? I'm guessing you mean to say UE5? Yes, I have. Nothing crazy, but I have. <laughs> Overwatch 2. <laughs> okay, I guess not everything free is good. You know what, let me go with this for right now. Let's, uh, let's apply all these changes. 
and do some some touch-ups here and there and then see where it goes from there overwatch 2 is free yeah it's free what's happening to who knows man <laughs> All right, the first thing I want to mess with is this hair. Show you how many, how many points is that? Only 94,000? All right, delete lower. Darn it. No, 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 no. Okay. And then we'll do that. Cool. And then we'll set the general direction of this gizmo. And then we'll go to the gear bend curve. Right. I can do something like this. Except I'll go here. Why is his model not looking how the official looks? Because I want to make it sexy. I'm going to do it my way. Uh, let's add another one in there. Twist, 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 twist. Use the hair locks so that she stand without the base on yours. Yeah, I guess I'm more going to be using them as like to support it. No, so you know, I think I'm gonna a little swoosh, you know. like a little swoosh there's some divots there i'm gonna fix that afterwards just kind of want to get a general flow now let's do this again and curve bring you down Let's have you like a little bit more up in the air. Something like that. Gonna have to adjust it up here afterwards. Yeah, the pivot is off on that. Let's do that manually.
Do I have a tutorial on this? No, I don't have any tutorials yet. Yet. One day, I'll make some. Where did I learn this from? Ah, oh, jeez. That's a lot of different places over the course of uh, a lot of years. <laughs> Honestly, any... Any decent sculpting tutorial, anatomy tutorial will will get you where you want to go. There's plenty out there. A lot of them are good. In my opinion, the the better ones are paid. There is plenty of free ones. But usually the paid ones are the better one. Yeah, and anatomy books. Yeah, I was too poor to to buy a thirteen hundred dollar program, but I wasn't so so poor that I couldn't save up some money and then buy a tutorial or save up some money and pay for like a a workshop. It's just I didn't have the money to pay for like a program that cost more than a thousand dollars when I was only like nineteen years old. <laughs> The rest would be easier to to do this manually. Yo, oh man, blue on black is so hard to read. Nerdy butcher, how you doing? The, the realist struggle starting out as a 3D artist, getting the damn program. Oh yeah, right, getting the damn program, true. Yeah, and Blender, Blender is 100% free. 100% free. Blender can do everything that you would need it to do. Blender was starting to be a thing when I got into college. 3D software was 3ds Max and like Rhino 3D. Yeah, it's about the same for me. When I started Blender wasn't... Hold on. Okay, Blender wasn't completely viable when I started back around like... Mid to late 2000s. But I would say for where it's at right now... It is very good. Blender kept crashing for you. You <laughs> usually, uh, <laughs> usually Maya is the one that crashes a lot. It's a very much a love-hate relationship with Maya. Always crashing. But yeah, Hudson's right. All 3D softwares crash.
Is a hard service mode never touched Maya. My only experience with Crashy Software was Unreal 3. Oh boy, Unreal 3. Gloves, animation, animation, video editing, all with Blender. Yeah, Blender really is like a like the the perfect the Swiss Army knife for for all 3D hobbyists out there. Might be. I'm no Blender expert, but no 3D software should be crashing on you that much. So there, there might be something, something going on over there. Hey Drake, how you doing? I should have some some gaps in here because like the midsection is thinner than the ends or whether I should just kind of close it and just have it be like one big shape kind of leaning to the one big shape but I don't know yet I don't know Thirty. Oof. Get, get some rest, Vicky. I'll see you next time. RWBY is over. Are you planning on doing some models sometime in the future? <laughs> I, I saw... Yeah, I saw that it was over. And then I saw... One of the 
voice actresses was doing like a stream using the model wasn't sure if it was real or not i mean i never really watched the show but i checked it out and like yeah it's it's the real deal it's the it's the person Oh, she was doing it for a while. Oh, okay. Well, good thing she thought ahead. <laughs> oh, monster. <laughs> Girl, <are> no balls. <laughs> this stupid on my carpet there's like a divot and the caster wheels just get stuck in them i hate carpet i need to rip this carpet out of here i'm really out there for carnage recently i saw a bunch of people crying over the ntr tag on twitter <laughs> people always cry over the uh the NTR tag. I would lie if I said it didn't make me want to mess with them. Yeah, I don't know what it is. Like, some people get like really, really bent out of shape over that. I don't know why. I don't understand. Yeah, like they actually get mad. Use rollerblade caster wheels. I could, or I can just rip this carpet out of here because carpet sucks. <laughs> I hate carpet. <laughs> 